this video is sponsored by BetterHelp. More about them at the end of the sketch. Okay, so next on the list, it seems like Prancer has a pretty serious UTI at the moment. Right, okay, can one of you, um, you know, get in there and check that out? Get in there? Oh, God! What else is on the agenda today? Well, we still need to figure out how to make more PS5s. Oh, yeah, no, yeah, no real rush on that. There's kind of a rush. Now, what about, um... <clears throat> Santa, you, you good? <clears throat> Santa? Did he just f die? I think he, I think, I mean, that was a heart attack, right? Like Santa just died? I think so, yeah. Okay, so who had heart attack as cause of death? I had heart attack, I did. I was way off, I had blunt force trauma. Oh, you really went for it, I had choking. Okay, that's 200 lollipops each to Snowflake. <coughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, you're... Santa, you're alive! Thank goodness! Did I just hear you guys betting on how I was going to die? What? No, that's, that's... What? We would never know! No, I heard you! Tinsel said he thought I was gonna die from blunt force trauma! What the hell, Tinsel? I did say that, yeah. I can't deny that I just said that. What is wrong with you elves? Okay, you know what? Fine, Santa, you got us. And if we could be quite frank, we are shocked that you are still somehow alive. Yeah, you know what? This is an intervention! No, you can't decide to turn an ongoing conversation into an intervention, I don't think. Well, you, that's what we're doing, because you know what, Santa? You gotta reconsider some of your lifestyle choices. What are you talking about? The cookies, Santa. What about them? At every house. You have cookies at every house around the world while you're giving out presents. No, not every house. Not houses of, you know, different religious beliefs or lower income. Yeah, that's problematic in a whole other way, and we should talk about that sometime. But Santa, do you know how many calories you're eating in one night? No, I mean, they don't leave me cookies in the boxes. I don't see the nutritional info. Right, well, we did the math, and it is billions of calories. Yeah, but I'm compensating by lifting presents and stuff. You know, I'm burning the energy. Okay, no, to burn that much in one night, you'd have to... I don't know, be the sun? Well, I'm hot, baby! Well, what about the milk? The milk, yeah! I need to wash down the cookies! A glass of milk at every house. You know there's an internet challenge where people try to drink one gallon of milk without barfing? How are you drinking so much milk and going about your night? Yeah, it's a miracle you're not vomiting, let alone constantly urinating. Okay, you know what? Who said I'm not constantly urinating? Ugh. Look, I like cow boob juice. Is that a crime? It's not a crime. No, it's just deeply troubling. Okay, so I don't have the best food habits, all right? That doesn't mean I'm gonna drop dead. It's not just the food, Santa. What else? Well, for one, you're breaking and entering into people's homes all night, and a lot of those homes are in the U.S. So? So how have you not been shot yet? That is a good point. That might be an actual Christmas miracle now that you mention it. Also, just constantly flying thousands of feet in the air all over the planet. Air defense systems are getting better and better around the world. Statistically, you will get shot down sooner or later. Well... Or just crash. You're going hundreds of miles per hour controlling large animals with like two little ropes. You've been a senior citizen for decades. We live in the coldest place on the planet. It doesn't just seem inevitable. It seems imminent. Look, live fast, die old. I say that constantly and I thought you guys loved that about me. Now I find out you have a freaking death pool going on. Santa. No, you know what? I thought we were close and you know, what can I say? This, you really broke this old man's heart. Santa, we're sorry. No, it does. It it breaks my heart. <clears throat> it breaks. <clears throat> I. Santa. Santa. Wow. All right, who had broken heart? That was my backup, actually. I had blunt force trauma and then broken heart. So that's a hundred lollipops each to tinsel. I'm not dead yet. Ah, dang it. Hi there, hello, it's me, I'm the Adstronaut. I'm out of your in ad space to talk to you about better health. Mental health is super important, and therapy is a good way to take care of yours. But therapists can be hard to find, and my buddy Florpflap gives me the worst advice. Have, Have you, you tried, tried setting, setting everything, everything on fire? fire? I will not be trying that. But luckily, BetterHelp is a thing. BetterHelp is the world's largest therapy service, and it's 100% online. They let you tap into a network of over 25,000 licensed and experienced therapists who can help you with a wide range of issues. Have, Have you tried, tried shooting lasers? 
answer, is that your problem? That's not even really a possibility, Florp Flap. To get started, you just gotta answer a couple of questions about your needs and preferences in therapy. That way, they can match you with the right therapist. After that, you can talk to your therapist however is most comfortable for you. I don't see why you need that. I already left you a voicemail explaining how to plant explosives. Yeah, that was not a helpful voicemail, Florp Flap. Basically, with better help, you get the same professionalism and quality you expect from in-office therapy, but with a custom pick therapist, more scheduling flexibility, and at a more affordable price. And hey, you can get 10% off your first month at betterhelp.com slash Ryan George. And if for whatever reason your therapist's not a good fit, you can change to another one at no extra charge. Explosive charge? Stop trying to blow up my problems, Flip Flap. Flap.